Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. Today I want to talk about um, a topic that I learned from Christina Jukes. Um, she's a, like a life coach, business life coach person. Um, that's the type of services that she offers. And she recommends that you, you smell your money in, in order to um, improve your relationship with money and also, also to attract more money. It may sound like a silly little tip, but you know, it works, right? And when I first saw her video, I tried to, I was, I started smelling money. Um, we have US currency here in Tortola and it was going okay, right? And um, I was in Trinidad a few weeks ago, that my home country, Trinidad and Tobago, right? And we have, um, our currency has different colors, like a hundred dollar note has is blue. You now have a new $50 bill is quite pretty. The dollar note is, uh, is um, red. The um, $5 note is, is green, different colors. The $20 bill is um, purple. I'll show you what it looks like, right? Whereas with the US dollars, the, the color of the dollar notes, all of them is basically the same color, right? So I noticed that um, when I was in Trinidad, I, the $50 note was looking so, so pretty, right? that um, I decided, I remembered her, her video and her tip and I decided to, I started to smell my money, right? And I sort of enjoyed the little task. Every morning I'll get up, I'll sort my money, make sure it's in order and everything and I'll smell my money. Let me show you what I have. <laughs> Let me show you the money. That's... So this is the $50 bill from Trinidad and Tobago. Like I said, it looks so pretty. I really, really liked it, right? And the $1 note and the $10 note, is, it's gray. And the $20 note, it's purple. So they're all different colors, make it like sort of fun, right? I was trying to keep, now she also recommend having your wallet. This is basically about the function of your wallet, right? She also recommends to have different currencies from different parts of the world within your purse. So, um, now I'm back in Tortola, I have my regular US currency, but I'm keeping the Trinidad and dollars in my purse, right? And I wanted to keep a $100 note um, with the set of what I already have, but I had to use it up. Anyway, so I have my money, my purse, I have, of course, I don't really have it mixed up with the um, with the US dollars. I have the Trini dollars separate, you know, I don't want to get it, get it mixed up. And I'm doing some house cleaning at my mom's house and I found these. These are Eastern Caribbean. I think it may be from somewhere. Yeah, EC currency from one of those other Caribbean islands. This is a $10 note and this is a $5 note. So I have this together with the um the TT dollars, Trinidad and Tobago dollars. So what I have been doing, I have like what I would like to do. This is my money here. Right? So I make sure they're in order and everything and they have no edges and stuff. I'll go through them every day, make sure they're in order. And I was, I what I like to like smell one at a time, like spend time with the money, right? So smell each one. After they, they have been sorted out and everything, I'll smell each one, you know? And just be in that <laughs> abundance of money. You know, I'll smell each one. Some people I just want to hold crap. Yeah, but I like to do it one at a time after I've sorted them out. Yeah. And this is my favorite one, the $50 notes. This one here. I love this one. It's so pretty. Really, really nice. Smell that. You know? So what I noticed, um, I, this just happened this week. Um, This week's maybe Tuesday, I think. I was doing some work for a client of mine, some bookkeeping services. That was basically my little side job that I do, right? And I had made an intention previously last year that I would like to do work for, work for him regular, like monthly, right? And uh, what I've been doing for him, he gave me some work to do, like for eight months. And now, um, when I came back from Trinidad, he gave me for, to do for like four months to tell the whole 12 months for last year. So then he said, you know, we need to do this on a monthly basis because you know, apparently some transaction happened and he couldn't remember what was going on. So he said, you know what? We need to do this on a regular basis, on a monthly basis, so that we could um, be able to answer all the questions that are required as it's still fresh in our memory. So I was so excited because, you know, that's regular work for me and regular income too as well, you know, and I, something that I really like doing, doing my bookkeeping and stuff. So that is a 
outcome of me smelling my money. I'm getting more money on a regular basis. No matter how small it is, at least you might be coming in on a regular basis, monthly basis. Um, I'm sure it's because of smelling my money. So I had to share that with you today. Um, again, don't don't scorn it. Um, give it a try and just have fun with it, you know. I'll leave a link for Christina Duke's video in the description box below. And listen to her, see what she has to say. And another lady who spoke about the two um, I, that I found as well is Carol. I think it's Carol Dory. She spoke about spending her money too as well. And there are two other ladies talking about spending their money too as well. And yeah, so here I am talking about spending my money too as well. Right? And um, yeah. So, spending money. Have fun with it. Be in the frequency of money and abundance of money. To attract more money into your life. Okay. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.